want to be happy. Uh, 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 what? Oh yeah, go back to the uh, yeah, okay, right there, stay right there, stay right there. We want to be blessed, happy, fortunate, mm -hmm. and enviable is he. Mm -hmm. A good study would, would go over blessed. Mm -hmm. oh. Psalms got a lot of them. Book of Revelation got a gang of them. Do a study on blessed. I mean, of course, the Psalms is Hebrew and the blessed is in the, in the, in the Book of Revelation is Greek. But just do a, a, a topical study on blessed. We, we're supposed to be a blessed people. Yes. I'm not talking about silver and gold. Come on. I'm talking about a, a mind made up. Come on, people that ain't coming down. When you're not coming down because you have restraints, you say, I'm going to do it God's way. That's a blessed person. When you, when you can decide what you're going to do with your destiny, that is a blessing. When you can say, you determine in your heart how far you're going to go in your walk with God, how deep you're going to go with the Lord. That is the blessing I'm talking about. I'm not talking about that other stuff. That pales in comparison. I want to have him. I want to have a relationship yes. with the Holy Ghost. Yes. With the yes. Yes. Of the Lord. I want to have a relationship with the Godhead. I want to be able to, you get what I'm saying? Yes. He not walk with God. I don't have to walk with God. God walks in me. Yes. 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 We're blessed. Yes. Why? Because God has made his, his abode in us. Yes. Yes. Sir. Thank you, Lord. I can't cast off restraint. I'm closing here. Where there is no apostolic prophetic or elevated sight or vision, mm -hmm. the people perish or cast off restraints or become pro pro prognosticators mm -hmm. of doom and gloom. Mm -hmm. Self-defecating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because the words that are in their mouth, we don't have the hope that is desired. Because mm -hmm. see, you gotta speak when hope. When hope is alive in you, your conversation changes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Am, I, am, I, am I right? Y'all yeah. know if we, we work from uh, Monday to Friday, Friday come, boy, your whole conversation changes. Yeah. <laughs> am I right? Yes. <laughs> My conversation changes on Mondays. Come on. <laughs> hey, man, I'm like, oh, pray the Lord. Yeah. I ain't got to study Tuesday. Oh, thank you. I, mean, I, got, I can wait till Tuesday to... Really crank it up today. I just blow today. <laughs> that's that's when God is recharging you. Yes, it is. Hope and give you a fresh initiative. Mm -hmm. It give it gives you the incentive to to remain steady, to stay committed, to stick to it. And, and, and stop stop pronosticating to yourself, telling you you never. Be anything. I, I can't never prophesy. I can never teach. I, I'll never be able to make three Sundays in a row. I'll never be able to come five Wednesdays in a row. And, <laughs> yeah, I, I, yeah, it could be done. But those are the things that the enemy likes to use our own speech against us. Where we become trapped with earthbound perceptions that keep us abased in the dust of carnality and defeat. I'm going to say that again. <laughs> we become trapped with the earthbound perception that keeps us abased in the dust of carnality and defeat. Mm -hmm. Why? Because we don't have a vision. Mm -hmm. This church ain't supposed to roam. Come on. Things are supposed to be upgraded. Yes. Mm -hmm. People's lives are supposed to upgrade. Yes. Things are supposed to improve. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna show you later on how to improve your life, but I'm just get, I'm just on the canvas right now. Hey Amen. I'm, I'm trying to set the canvas straight. I got the ink. I'm trying to make sure the image is clear. Mm -hmm. We are supposed to upgrade. Up, upgrade is a better quality of life. Jesus came there for quality. Mm -hmm. yes. See, most folks just want to know and have been taught in salvation about the gospel of salvation. He came to give us quantity, mm -hmm. and so they waste quantity. They waste decades, amen, not trying to improve their life in any shape or form. Yeah, you're supposed to lose your life. But I got news for you. If you lose yours, you get a better quality of life. However, if you don't empty your soul, your mind, will, and emotions, the life that you're looking for will never show up. 
Because God can never do what he wants for you until he do it in you. So if you believe in something without you, it has to start in you. It's time to soar. We'll talk about that next week. It's time to soar. It's time to mount up with wings. It's time for our future to be prophetic. I'm serious. I'm serious, 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 serious. There's a challenge on me. There's a challenge on this house. There's a challenge over every member. Trust me. There's an apostolic cha uh, challenge on me. There's an apostolic urgency on me. I, I, from time to time I teach, and I'm teaching as a, a prophetic teacher or apostolic teacher, but the, now in this season, I may teach, but the apostolic grace is there. Yes. The wisdom of God. Mm -hmm. They will yeah. shut up yeah. the gainsayers where they can't resist. Yeah. He said, I'm going to give you a wisdom that will shut the yeah. mouths of the gainsayer. Yeah. I'm telling you. And what is the mouth, mouth? I heard yesterday, it's the Cretans, where Paul wrote to the churches in, 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 in Crete. And, and, and I think it was Titus. And he called them, he called them slow bellies. Mm -hmm. That's what he said. That's right. And he was basically telling them because the word Crete means lust. Yes. Mm -hmm. That can be the lesser size, the lesser special, the pride of life. These right. things right. are hostile against the assignment. Yeah. It makes your belly slow. Yeah. With me, I can't digest. Yeah. 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 Y
Hmm. Father, we bless you. We thank you for this word. Amen. Thank you for letting the hammer break the rocks in pieces. Father, we, we, I just ask that you, even as uh, Ecclesiastes says, that wisdom is better than many strong men. Father, I thank you that wisdom scales the city and bring down the trusted strongholds. Father, I thank you for the voice of wisdom on this morning. That strongholds are coming down. That things in, in people's mindset that, that, that they keep entertaining is coming down. Father, in the spirit, we're going after those things. And Father, we put it on notice. That Jesus Christ is Lord. Yes. And that he's Lord over all. He's Lord over this house. He's Lord over, 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 <laughs> over my mouth. He's Lord over my mind, my hands, the assignment, the mandate that you've given to this house. You're Lord. And Father, we, we look to you. And we understand it. And those that don't understand it, even as Philippians 3 says, that you will bring it to them. That they'll be uh, if those that are otherwise minded. You even bring this to their remembrance. And Father, those that have uh, cast aside their hope, and those who, who are lagging behind, and those who are caught between, caught between two opinions, trying to figure out to leave, to stay or to leave, or or just to hang out for another. Father, I pray, not that they go, that they change. Father, I pray that they change because no matter where they go, change is imminent. And I pray over this house that the imminency of your, of your transformative grace will chase them and hound them. Father, I release you to hound them, the angels of heaven, to hound each and every one of the individuals that's under the sound of my voice. The angels that have charge over them, that hearken to the voice of your word coming through them. Father, I, I, I set an assignment apostolically. I put a demand yes, on that which is eternal. Yes. Not their condition, not their situation, but that which is eternal, the thing that they carry in seed form. Father, I release the water of the moment to bring it to fruition. Yes. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. amen.